What's up everyone, it's me, Storm. Thanks to the latest update in Lost Day on Earth, you no longer need to activate the Watchtower to craft the Military Backpack. The new Smuggler's Camp event was an unexpected addition and provides some of the best rewards in the game for completing it. These rewards include SWAT gear, engine parts, copper and steel. Steel is obviously the best reward as it is required to craft the Military Backpack. This is a big change, because even if you are a new player, you are still able to make the backpack. The extra storage slots will help a ton with the rate of progression and greatly reduce overall travel time. For the smuggler's camp event, I recommend repairing the turret and giving Tom some military armor and a melee weapon for just the green and blue crates. You will need a gun for the red crate and giving a gun to Tom will also help a lot. Just make sure that Johnny stays alive so that he can open up the crates for you. It is possible to get steel from both the blue and red crates. If you get copper bars, you will need to craft the refined melting furnace to make steel bars. It's not that hard to get it, you will just need to farm some oak wood in any red zone forest. This update is one of the best updates that have been added to the game because it is beneficial for all players. Good luck in the smuggler's camp, I hope you guys get the military backpack as well. Thanks for watching.